and South Africa starting off with a great moment on board of this Kalami circuit with Patrick Depay and the six-wheeled Tyrrell. In the warm-ups, James Hunt took his third consecutive pole. He's ahead of Carlos Pace, Nicky Lauda and De Peye. Well, immediately after the start, Lauda starts pushing very hard behind Hunt's McLaren, followed by Schechter and De Peye, who are waiting for their chance. From the 7th to the 78 laps, the Ferrari gets in front, and that is the last we see of it. The race is marked by a terrible accident. Renzo Zorzi's shadow is at a standstill on the track, its engine smoking. Two officials rush towards it, crossing the track from the other side, and tragedy strikes. The second official is struck by the second shadow, which is accelerating hard, driven by the Welshman, Tom Price. Well, the official is killed instantly, as is Price whose helmet is almost ripped off by the official's fire extinguisher. A nightmare scenario in which the shadow continues in its trajectory and rams the Liget driven by Jacques Lafitte, who's struck by the driver who's already dead. The 5th of March 1977 saw one of the most appalling accidents in the history of Formula One. Lauda won the race despite everything and described it as one of his greatest victories. Schecter second in front of Depeye, Hunt, Mass and Watson. <laughs> 